Our Lady under various titles and manifestations has been an inexhaustible source of inspiration and solace for billions of souls across the globe. She is venerated under an uncountable number of names, each reflecting a different aspect of her divine grace and compassion. From the humble peasant girl of Fatima to the indigenous woman of Guadalupe, each apparition of Our Lady has touched the hearts of her children in a unique and profound way, adapting herself to the specific needs and cultural contexts of those who sought her intercession. It is this infinite adaptability, this willingness to meet us where we are, that sets Our Lady apart as the quintessential mother of all mankind. The apparitions at Fatima, Portugal, in 1917 are perhaps the most famous of all. Here, Our Lady appeared to three young shepherds, Lucia, Francisco and Jacinta, as the Lady of the Rosary. She imparted to them a message of prayer, penance and conversion, warning of the coming wars and suffering that would engulf the world unless mankind turned back to God. This message, which was later revealed to include the secret of Fatima continues to resonate with people of all faiths and backgrounds, offering hope in the midst of turmoil. In Lourdes, France, in 1858, Our Lady appeared to a humble peasant girl named Bernadette Saupirus. As Our Lady of Lourdes, she instructed Bernadette to dig in a particular spot where she discovered a spring of water. This spring has since become known for its healing properties, with thousands of miraculous cures attributed to it over the years. The Shrine at Lourdes has become a beacon of hope and faith for the sick and suffering, drawing pilgrims from around the world who seek comfort and solace in the Divine Presence. Our Lady of Guadalupe, venerated in Mexico and beyond, is perhaps the most well-known apparition in the Americas. Here, she appeared to a humble Aztec convert named Juan Diego in 1531, bearing an image of herself imprinted on his tilma, or cloak. This image, now known as the Miracle of Guadalupe, features Our Lady as an indigenous woman with features that mirror those of the native peoples of Mexico. This striking image served as a powerful symbol of divine love and acceptance, helping to spread Christianity throughout the Americas and unite diverse cultures under the banner of the Virgin Mary. In addition to her specific titles and apparitions, Our Lady is also known by other names that reflect different aspects of her role in salvation history. For example, as Our Lady of Grace, she embodies the fullness of God's grace made available to us through the incarnation and the redemptive work of her Son, Jesus Christ. As Queen of Heaven, she reminds us of her exalted position in the divine hierarchy and her intercessory power before the throne of God. And as Mother of Perpetual Hell, she offers solace and protection to all those who call upon her in times of need. 